You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Excited to show you a new game here from 1967. It's a shopper game called Clean Sweep. It's game number 600 in their collection of games. And let's see, it says, Pop the trash can, sweep like mad, get the good stuff, skip the bad. For two to four players, and this is a big box, so I can't really show you much more of the side panels. But other than that, I think... Uh, we can get going on the board game. Now the instructions are on the inside cover. So when I come back, we'll take a look at those. All right, here's the instructions and scoring. You'll see it says 1967 and then other shopper games. So basically you're setting up the game board. You're rotating a center sign and then that's going to pop out garbage. And depending on the type of garbage, whether it's uh, the white litter being good litter or the color litter being the bad litter. And then here is the point value. So the player with the highest score wins the game. So that's pretty much it. Now let's take a look at the board game. All right, now we've learned how to play the game. Let's check out the game board. Now this is two sections. So this cardboard game board, like a standard game board, fits inside these rails and your trays. So these kind of snap in together all the way around. Then you can set your uh, game board inside. I'll show you the pieces in a little bit, but these are all the good and the good and the bad garbage pieces. And if you look at the game board now, you will see obstacles all over. That's because once things fall out of the trash, you're sweeping and running into things. You'll have to knock things out from underneath the different obstacles to try to push the bad pieces to your opponents and flick them. And then while you're trying to move the good garbage into yours. But remember, they're going to be trying to flick them into your trays. Once they're in your trays, you cannot take them out. Let me move a little bit closer here and check out the game board in more detail. So take a look at the game board now. Very colorful, lots of different scenes going on. Like this guy here took the tricycle from the little boy. He's crying. You've got wet paint over here and a guy that's falling off. And then a police officer with a cat. Other kind of funny stuff on here. And these obstacles now are meant to just pop in and out. So when you set up the game, it says bridge. So you put your bridge there and just lock them in. So that pretty much will stay there. There's also a couple little signs that twist in and out. No littering. And then uh, a bench back here, and then what looks to be like a little garbage area here. Not sure exactly what. Oh, trash bin that's tipped up, and then another bridge. So let's take a look at this clean sweep garbage can, because the whole game is based off of this garbage can. Because, here, let me take it off of the game board here. It just twists on. Once it's in, it should be in. Okay, see that? And then, how does this work? Well... Once you fill it up with garbage, you're actually twisting. Each person is twisting. Inside, you'll see a slot there. Once the peg, the correct peg, gets to that slot, watch, it moves up. And then the person's going to turn, and then it moves up. And then the last two, one more. Then by the time it hits the last one, it pops totally out, and all the garbage falls all over the place. So that's pretty much the game board and everything. Let me... uh. Check out another angle here and we'll look at the pieces now. All right, so I've slid the game board over, moving in all the different little pieces. These are the white pieces. They're the good ones that you want to sweep into your garbage can. I just wanted to show you there's like pianos in here, keys, little diamond rings. See, that stuff gets stuck underneath the, the bridge. There's violins, binoculars. I don't know, that looks like a camera, a little camera, doesn't it? Horseshoes, a flashlight. I'm not sure what that is. Some kind of little accent piece. A watch. There's even a knife in there. That's the good stuff. Let me move that out of the way. Then I'll dump out the bad stuff. This is all the stuff that no one wants in the garbage. All right, so you've got little tuna cans, bottles, rackets, fish cans, gears, horseshoes, other little bottles, and I don't know, it looks like a piece of toast or something. All that stuff's the bad stuff. So what I want to do next is I'm going to mix this all up and get ready to put it in the garbage can, and I'll show you how the game is played. All right, so I have all my pieces now in a bag, and I've jostled them all up so that I can mix the whites from the colors. And then, so what I'm doing is pressing and then turning to slowly move it down where it needs to be to that last peg. Once it's on the last peg, it's now locked in. I think I can... Turn it right to there so you can see clean sweep. Now I need to pour in the garbage. So here we go. We're almost ready to show you how these things pop out and fly everywhere.
Almost. So I think I asked, who's had this game? Who's seen this game? Who's played this game? If you like these kinds of games. We probably have more board games than anything else to show you, but we only do them on one every Sunday, approximately. Okay, here we go. So now, remember now, here, let me uh, let me set up one more time. I want to see, show you the brooms and everything. Hold on. All right, so I moved it back up again because I want to just give you some perspective here. So I'll do a couple turns at this height, and then I'll bring it back down so you can see it. It's pretty cool. So here we go. Now, a person's going to turn... And watch what happens now after you hit that first click. And everybody's going to want to be moving fast here. Okay, so it's a little one. So just a few things fell out. So what are you going to do? You're going to sweep these away. Once they're all cleared out of the board, and you've moved them all to your opponents while they're trying to sweep them to you, then you're going to move on to the next person. They're going to turn again. Okay, now more falls out the second time. So let me move it back in now so you can kind of see there's going to be a lot of action. People sweeping things and moving things all over the place. If something gets stuck under a bridge, you're going to have to, you know, work it out so that you can get it and move it on. So let me change the perspective again. All right, so now watch the next turn. More should come out even. Okay, so now lots come out. Remember, the board's cleared each time. So there's a lot of white in front of my section which I want to grab as quick as possible without moving anything in. But I see this green. I want to try to push it over there onto them while they're trying to push things back my way. So let's say everything's cleared out. And here we go. Getting close now. Okay. It's kind of locked. One more. So the last one should pop everything out. I think we're there. Go slow. Ah, there you go. That's not even the last one. So there's one more. Once it hits it, it should all come out. Whoa, that flew up in the air. All the way across my table to the other side. So just look, there's pieces everywhere. So you're just going nuts trying to, you know, pick out the pieces you want. Well, accidentally you might grab, you know, a couple color colored pieces while you're moving a white piece in. And you got these tiny rings. Look how small that is. So if that gets stuck under a bridge or somewhere, you're constantly moving around, battling for position, really. Trying to sweep everything to someone else's side. Interesting game. This is a game of clean sweep from Shopper. So let's hear it in the comments. Do you like these kind of game board videos? Do you like to learn about game boards like this? We'd like to hear from you, because like I said, we've got a ton of them. And again, thanks for watching. Not again, actually... Thanks for watching. It's really appreciated. If you want to see other board games and you're into that kind of stuff, look in the description. You'll see a playlist. We have playlists for all the major board game companies. Or just search our channel. And thanks for watching. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. You can always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.